the key thing a company can do to protect themselves is to do a risk assessment. It may sound backwards that you would look at what your challenges are before you do a, a plan on how to meet those challenges. But until you assess where you are vulnerable, you really don't know what to protect. And vulnerability comes in different areas. It could be an attack externally on your data. It could be an attack internally on your data from an employee who, uh, or a temporary employee, or a visitor, or a vendor who has access to your system and who um, has a, an agenda that's different from yours. Um, it could be a, a simple accident, a, a lost laptop, a lost uh, computer file, a, la a lost backup tape. Looking at all of those various scenarios helps you identify how you need to construct a risk assessment plan and a, and a response plan to meet those um, potential threats. Speed is important in responding to a data breach. The most critical thing that you can do uh, when you learn that there has been an, an unauthorized access to your database or to your system is to isolate it. Disconnect it from the internet, disconnect it from other systems as much as you can. Pull that plug. Make sure that you can isolate the portion of the system if possible. If it's not possible to just isolate that one portion, take the whole system down and make sure that you can preserve what it is that you have at the time that you are aware of the incident. Getting the uh, system imaged so that you can preserve that evidence of the intrusion is also critical. But unplugging from the outside world uh, is the first critical step. You have a variety of stakeholders when you're dealing with an incident response. You have your board of directors who need to hear the truth. Hearing the truth is uh, sometimes difficult, uh, especially when the truth is not good news. But they do need to hear the truth and uh, making sure that they are provided information as early as possible is critical. Another stakeholder is uh, your employees or your customers, the people whose information was compromised. They need to hear the truth. They need to hear not only what happened, but what you've done to fix it, how you've resolved the situation so that it's not gonna happen again. There's really not much you can do to prevent a data breach. It's gonna happen. It's not if, it's when. But there are steps that you can take that help deter a data breach. One of those is encryption. Uh, encrypting information that you have on portable devices, on laptops, on flash drives. Things that can be disconnected from your system, including backup tapes, all should be encrypted. The number of data incidents that involve a lost laptop or a last lost flash drive that hold personal information could all be prevented by having the data encrypted. So I think encryption is a key element to making sure that at least you reduce the incidents that you may come up with.